Wow, a movie star. Wow. <laughs> I'm behind your head as well, Tony. You've got a sort of lovely, I'm in lights behind you. How nice. I'm, 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 I'm standing in front of a theater and this is the marquee. Um, I'll tell you what, when I think of, of the roles you play, I don't normally think of comedy. And yet you do such a wonderful job in this film. Well, you know, I think you're not the only one who doesn't think of me as comedy. I think, you know, it's been, you know, the, the, if I could <laughs> one day tell a few stories about, you, you know, the numbers of directors who have uh, wanted me for various comedies and the studios have said no. <laughs> <laughs> you know that would you 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 know it would be interesting, but that's because they don't think of me as such, and yet I've been um, you know quietly playing in this field for for quite a while, and um, you know won an Emmy apparently, even yes. though I, I did that as well for for something comedic last year, which was uh, which was a, a wonderful wonderful thing um, for the for the State of the Union with Chris O'Dowd. Um, so yes, quietly, I'm as well as being dramatic. I have a sense <laughs> of humor. That. Well, but this film also is is kind of an endearing, empowering, uh, frustrating kind of look at life. And and what a tremendous writing job uh, uh, for this film. It's it's beautifully written. Jay, Jay is a master of dialogue. I mean, he he, you know. The actors who got it, you know, and that wasn't everybody, but the actors who read it and got it just, you know, couldn't wait to get their hands on and, and get into playing these scenes. I mean, you know, I remember when Chris Messina came on set. I mean, he was just prepared. He was ready. It was like, oh, it was magic that day. You know, it was it was like a 12 page scene, that scene where the lawyer comes into Marla's office and you know, fully underestimates her, thinks he's going to be done in five minutes. He's going to show her the money and he's going to be out of there. And Marla is a completely, uh, she's on another level. I mean, she's not anything that he was expecting. And um, I think it was, a, it was a real sort of chess match. We had such a fun time playing that scene because Jay writes so beautifully and each character has strength in every scene and everybody wants something. So the drama is always sizzling. And I imagine working with the likes of Peter Dinklage, Diane Wiest, Alicia Witt, who I've known for years, um, it's got to bring the whole thing up. Um, it, it buoys everything. Yes, every every actor sort of made those characters themselves. I mean, Alicia, yeah, she was great as this doctor who, you know, everybody is has, uh, has a dark side, I think. It, you know, it's a cocktail of you know, characters in responsible positions who have, uh, you know, who do things to for sort of with nefarious intent. I mean, you know, you've got Isaiah Whitlock Jr. as the judge, uh, you know, who is very fun, quietly funny. I mean, I, he makes me laugh so much uh, in those scenes. Um, and it's the sort of the way that Jay so cleverly plays on the American system, the way that the system is set up for these dastardly deeds to be done. Uh, in a way, the, the system is the villain, really. But Diane um, was, uh, you know, thank goodness that she agreed to do it. I mean, she was just, she just ran away with that part so gloriously, you know, from the Jennifer Peterson that we meet, you know, this lovely woman in her house, you know, with her lovely things and her teapot and her reading the paper. And I sort of, you know, extract her with a sort of, you know, in this kind of, with this scheme, you can't really believe it's happening, but I, I take her away from all of that. And then, you know, she deteriorates into a sort of fog of prescription medication, but underneath it, you know, she's fighting and she's, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a wonderful performance by her. It is. It's a, it's a, it's a beautifully done dark comedy and, and thank you for doing it. And thank you for your time today. Thank you. Lovely to see you, Tony. And I, I wish to goodness it were playing at a theatre near you. <laughs> Lovely to see you again, too.